Hey, it's Landon Collins from the Washington Redskins. You watching Mutt Frost, stay frosty, do your thing. Hell to Redskins. What's up, guys? It's the director and the trumpet monkey. And welcome back to another episode of M-U-T Force. <laughs> Mud Force. Trumpet Monkey. Mud Force! I think it's fair to say we may yeah. have just witnessed the best promo in recent history from Adam Ultimate Team. So why don't you tell the good people Ever. what to expect in this episode of Mud Force. Tonight on Mud Force with the director and Trumpet Monkey, we have new backgrounds. Go Raiders! We break down the signature players, the new legends, and all of the theme diamond players. Back to you, director. And with that, let's get into this week's banger content. All right, Trumpet Monkey, a lot to cover today. Last week, I mean, like, we had like 32 banger cards just uh, dropped into the game, but we did have two amazing cards dropped earlier this week as well. Let's start with this Eddie Jackson, probably the best free safety in yeah. the game right now. With, with two caveats, Director, yes, he's awesome. Yes, it's a great item. In real life, he rocks. 93 zone is insane. However, 93 play rec, oh my God. Yeah. However, one, he's too damn slow because two, he costs like a million coins. So so that's that's where I stand on this one. If he costs a million coins on Xbox, I cannot imagine how much he must cost on the PC. <laughs> that's ridiculous. But if you can't afford this guy, or if you can be patient enough to wait till his power up pass is available, I think he's gonna be pretty crazy. 93 zone, 93 play rec. It doesn't yeah. get any better than that. Take a look at this, Christian McCaffrey as well. Oh. The best third down running back in the entire game. Some of the best catchings and the best mismatching as far as receiving halfbacks go. What do you see that Christian McCaffrey offers to the Mutt player? Run CMC. Now this one, again, again, falling victim to the fact that Marcus Allen and Todd Gurley are in the game for a third of the price, sometimes a quarter of the price. Marcus Allen, go and pick up Marcus Allen, guys, if you do not have him already. Just again, too expensive, I'm sorry. Very happy for Panthers fans, though, and if you got him, then I'm happy for you. If I recall, and I, I guess I haven't checked because I haven't really thought about getting this car because of how expensive he is. I remember him having really high stamina. He has 91. Okay, Ooh. so he's getting close. I think receiving backs need 95 to get armbar. That's something to keep an eye on for Christian McCaffrey's Yoach. next card. All right, John Mike, those are the signatures uh, from last week. I don't know if we're going to be see seeing more back. next week. Maybe we see the return of heavyweights. Question. Yeah. Question. Where are the heavyweights? Yeah. It, it, it seems where are the like... flashbacks and where are the veterans? I mean, like, I don't understand. Is it weekly content? Oh, who knows? I'd love a schedule. Love the team in EA, but give us a schedule, guys. A schedule would be nice. It seems like they're going to try and release something every week, and it, may, it looks like it's going to vary between the signatures, heavyweights, veterans, etc. But it would be nice to know what's coming and when. We do know what's coming today, Trumpet Monkey, in the Ooh. brand new Legends. Take a look at what EA's got up their sleeves this weekend. Damn, couple of nice willies coming your way from the internet. That's right. You don't get to say that very often. No, I know. Uh, I love, I love how fast they made this dude though. Like, come on, 83? Like, I mean, you you would be, yes, in a, in a Chiefs team team, you probably got at least 25 Chiefs in there, right? Yeah. So you're looking at like 84, and if you're going to power them up, 85. That's pretty nice, mate. You know, and then like the zone coverage is going to be pretty, pretty dapper as well. Um, really nice middle linebacker card. Uh, let's see. He could be a bargain. Watch that auction hole because that's a really good item right there. Yeah, uh, the limited edition cards. I mean, for heaven's sakes, we got Kellen Winslow last week and I wasn't able to pick up the full card because of how expensive he was. I have to imagine Will and Lanier is going to be pretty dang expensive as well. But yeah. check out his power up. Maybe he can get up to 81, 82 speed. That'll get the job True. done at middle linebacker. Let's take a look at the next cat right here. Let's go with the Raider first. Willie Brown. Yay. 
ready to look at this. Now, what's right about this card is that if you have a uh, lockdown, um, what, even just like tier one lockdown? Isn't it? I believe so. Correct us. Brutalize us in the in the comments below if, if I'm wrong. And you've got 90 zone and 90 man, which are both of the thresholds this year. 87 speed and Willie Brown is a glitch. A million percent is a glitch. Um, I cannot wait to pick him up. I've got the coins. I will be investing heavily, director, in the Willie. And um, yeah, this this is awesome. Like literally literally hero of the Super Bowl. I, I feel like with how glitchy the passing game has been, maybe not glitchy, but just how outmatched wide receivers have been lately, uh, Arik should be overpowered against cornerbacks. It's nice to see some of these corners come in with the speed that's required to keep up with some of these receivers. And I think Willie Brown's Dude. probably the best among them all. 87 speed, 6-1, both thresholds, tick. And on your theme team, this guy is gonna go absolutely ham. Let's take a look at the uh, director's hometown hero in Steve Love Young. it! Ooh! Love it! Why's a hometown hero? Is he from your town? Bruh, I ran into this guy at my mall last year. And I was like, what's up? And he wouldn't sign anything for me. That was kind of the reality check. But he's a super cool cat. He lives literally like 10 minutes from my house. What? Yeah. Go and have a barbecue with Steve Young. That'd be some Don't good drop a bait, right? <laughs> Don't drop a bait. He was a legendary <laughs> player at BYU, and I can see the stadium from my house. But this guy is going to make people regret throwing all their coin at Patrick Mahomes because look at these stats, yeah. dude. This is insane. 81 speed. Yeah. He's meeting most of the thresholds as far as passing when you power oh, him yeah. up, get some chems on him, dude. Oh, yeah. This is going to be one of the wildest quarterbacks in Madden right now. And so, he should I, be, bro. It's Steve Young. It's Steve Young. And I love it. For once, like Steve Young is coming out and the stats reflect the man, the myth, the legend. I'm really massively in favor of, of taking this guy up to an 86 with the power up card. And I can't wait to see what the stats are like there, but I think they're gonna be really good comparably even to, to Andrew Luck. And I've never really used to Steve Young, so I'm kind of looking forward to that. So I when we're spoiled right now. I, I love it. I'm, I'm getting to use all kinds of cards that I never use. Like Andrew Luck's my quarterback. Now Steve Young might be my quarterback week to week. I love it. I think I think 86. If we're playing by the rules of EA and how they upgrade things, I would say maybe his 70 or his 86 would have like 78 speed, maybe 79. He'd still have I'm somewhere okay in the that. realm of like 84 throw power, 85 yeah. short, 85 medium, 82 deep. That's a really serviceable quarterback right now. So nice. And it's Steve Young. And it's so Steve happy. Young. And for once, it feels like Steve Young came out and he feels like a fast quarterback, yes. which he yes. was. Super big yes. fan of the Steve Young. Might end up on my team tomorrow. Who knows? We're in the in the AM. All right, Joe Monkey. The reason that we sped through the first segment is because we have 32 <laughs> cards to go through for the team diamond we know. I need you to mentally prepare yourself right now i'm mentally prepared uh, wait wait us me i've got to mentally prepare mentally the grab the aura mentally. around you <laughs> not what i had Order in mind but rats. we can we, <laughs> we, i think we can harness <laughs> our energy and get through the team diamond <laughs> now i think and people will disagree. I think yeah. this is the best promo we maybe have ever had in Madden Ultimate Team. And yes, Ooh. the players may not be where everybody wants them to be, but who cares? It's 32 what? legends in but, but, one but wait. drop. Yeah, that's what I'm, that's in, that's incredible when you word it like that. And what, but all the players, they all go to 90 overall. That's what I'm that's saying. Like I think phenomenal. that's something people are understanding about this promo as well. So we'll go over that as we jump through this promo. Yeah. But even for instance, this Patrick Surton, we'll start with him. 85 overall, 85 speed. Nothing jumps off the page as a must have cornerback right now. But think about him plus five overall past this. You're looking close to what, 89, 90 speed. You're getting into the 80s for zone coverage. This is probably one of the better cards to pick up because of that. It's awesome. He's awesome. And then like, remember the whole idea behind this, okay? And this was, I want to throw this out there because a lot of people are like, oh my God, why did we get this guy? This was a very, very difficult task for the for the Mutt team as well. Oh yeah. To, to correlate and organize 
like in one promo nearly a year's worth of, of legends and former players very very difficult to do okay and um they put so much thought into it and they tried believe they I mean, we we had some fly on the wall moments where we were privy to information we wanted to talk about this promo for so long we weren't allowed to and we didn't want to didn't want to break nda but we know how hard they worked and the thought they put into it and i personally feel like they nailed it <laughs> Every, yeah everyone dude. except everyone except the kicker for the broncos but who cares because it's the broncos <laughs> <laughs> in that but, um, instance they that, absolutely 100 percent perfected yeah. this promo yeah they did and and the fact that you can get him up to that 90 it's and it's not taking that much what is also really cool okay is that you can use during the power process your power up passes on these guys and then sell the actual team diamonds and get some extra coin back and in many cases not only are you breaking even but you're coming out with additional coin especially on pc where the market's a little more barren i mean i i just think it's like it's it's really really cool to, we to just spent like three minutes three minutes on players. One, one item <laughs> to pick up 32 new players for ultimate team fan favorites nonetheless yeah Organize yeah. that even between last Madden and this Madden has to be absolutely crazy. So we got to give, yeah. I mean, I know there's some people that may not agree with our optimism, but we have to give credit where credit's due. And I think this is one of the promos that's going to be remembered yeah. positively. I got to tell you, it, it's it's the best promo in a long, long time. Uh, I, I, I mean, I'm, I'm having a hard time thinking what tops it, but we'd love to hear from you. Yeah. Which, which is the best promo in your opinion of all time in Mutt? Let us know. Uh, we did just spend five minutes talking about one card though, so we'll fly through. One, one point of order, director, point of order, oh boy. You dropped an epic video just the day before this one came out, breaking down which team cams all of these guys can get. Let's link that in the description. Yes. So we won't necessarily touch on that right here in this one. If you guys want to know which which teams can get, uh, sorry, which cards can get which team cams, go and look at that video right there. Um, Sertain, thumbs up for me because of speed. Anyway, if you do power them all the way up. Absolutely. Next item. Next item, Andre Reed. Not unfamiliar to the Mutt uh, game base. Uh, take a look at this guy, 6'2", 85 speed at 86 overall. Again, we're going to put in our heads like, you want to give him that plus four bump for 90 overall. So he's going to get close to like 88, 89 speed. Mm. That's pretty nasty. And Andre Reed always performs mm. over he does overall. He's freaking awesome. Uh, thumbs up for me as well. I am looking for one more wide receiver director that I want to put in my, in my team. More than likely the slot as well. Okay, so I got my Randy. All right. All right, I got my Randy. Yeah. And 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 then I've also got my um, Torrey Holt. But that slot receiver position i'm looking for someone i think i'm gonna pick one up from this promo right here looking at on looking at you andre checking you out bud catching looking traffic at, at 84 will definitely do you a couple Ooh. favors in the slot next up we got jason seahorn <laughs> <laughs> some giants fans like lost it this morning when jason Dude. seahorn was announced take a look uh, at this guy this man so good man this is so good okay uh, amazing, amazing uh, item when you get him all the way up to 90 as well. Uh, I really, really dig, dig, dig this card right here, man. So, like, like seriously happy, man. I, like, I he think was he's solid. one of the fastest corners in the game now. And some people are like, oh, man, oh, yeah. but his own coverage kind of sucks. I think when you get, like, 80 plus, it's going to perform pretty well. It's not until you get into like the high 90s that you maybe even gonna notice a difference as far yeah. as what I've seen so far. Well, the threshold again uh, that we've been able to determine on the grapevine is 90 once again in terms of the reactions. However, I am not noticing that unless you have an X Factor activated, yeah. in my humble opinion. So, but, but really, really nice. Dig the card, thumbs up for me. Very, very nice card. Next up, let's get to Trumpet Monkey's guy. <laughs> Dave the Casper Tat in for the Raiders. Tell me what you think of this Ghost guy. I know he's on post. your team. Yeah, oh, mate, he's awesome. So, like, he gets up to 80 speed. Um, Really, really solid. He's actually, his run block and his lead block are, like, a really gnarly as well. He might just go ahead and be like a, a budget, or not even a budget, just like a complete like H back, like a utility halfback tight end kind of dude. You know, he can even play wide receiver. Like he's his break, his break press, his release is really really epic. Um, so far for me, like he's caught a few touchdowns. Uh, he does come with like the red zone threat as well, which means like higher chance of catch in one on one coverage. I don't have it activated because I got 
all my X factors on my running backs right now, but we'll see what the future holds for for the ghost. Um, I, I was, want this to one hear so what happy. red zone looks like in game because if it's a literally high point cheese like last year, you gotta do it, bro. And I'll put it well, right on my Kellen Winslow when I get the chance. I just like like this guy's a Raider legend. Um, and this was a happy, happy mutt moment for me. It really, really was one of the happiest mutt moments uh, because I believe the last he was in was uh, was mutt Madden 15, and I had I was not playing mutt at that stage. So this is the first time I've seen the ghost. What and you just said, I've heard a couple of times today. This is the happiest mutt moment I've had. Yep. That's why this promo hits it out of the park. So Dave Casper couldn't be happier for He's you, great. my friend. Next up, we got Corey Dillon. Yeah, the Patriot, great. I'm kidding. <laughs> the Bengals great. Um, again, like like he's just one of those fan favorites, right? So so Bungles and Pats fans, happy for him. Um, like obviously when it comes to uh, halfbacks, it's a pretty crowded space right now. You know what I, I mean? I like, actually think Corey Dillon stands out, and I'm gonna tell you why. There are yeah, very buddy. few power halfbacks in the game right now, especially with this speed. So uh, Corey Dillon's going to be able to get an ability called Bruiser, which is basically Ooh. arm bar mixed in with another ability that excels your trucking. So he Ooh. is going to be a force to be reckoned with. I know 85 speed doesn't seem fast, but he's the fastest halfback with arm bar right now. And I think it's going to start showing up in head to head as soon as this weekend. And that break tackle is pretty rad too. Yeah. I'm with you, director, man. There's something for everybody here. That's the most important thing. And then bump up that speed. I think he gets 86 speed. I think that's his max Ooh. speed at 90 overall with arm bar. And one more thing before we move on. And he doesn't meet the threshold to get jukebox, but he meets these the the spin or the the juke threshold that's in game. So 88 with Kim. So he'll be able to have really nice crispy juke moves as well as arm bar. So that's kind of a sneak peek of what we're gonna see with Saquon Barkley later on. Next up, <laughs> you say his name. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Jerovicious. There we go. Very nice. Six foot five, still alive. I dress to a T. Got 85. Catching traffic. Come watch me. There we go. Uh, this guy's awesome. I love it. I love it. I don't know why I just sang. Um, I dig it though. Man, I'm watching this guy too. I got my eye on you, Joe Jerovicious. I, I think that 6-5 frame, <laughs> his specific archetype allows him to get red zone threat at the wide receiver position, oh. which is really nice. Uh, he's going to have 86 speed, I think, when he's powered up all the way. Ridiculous wow. catch and traffic. He's kind of like running a tight end at the wide receiver position. Pretty um, much. The only knock I had on this card is I thought he was Vincent Jackson at a glance when I first saw him this morning. <laughs> like, ah! Oh, okay. He's pretty good, too, though. Just not Dude. Chargers eligible. Happy for Jake Stein as well. Um, dig it. Uh, I, I'm, this is one of the wide receivers I'm eyeing as well. I want to I want to play with different different players this year man so like this is about as different as it gets it's awesome very very nice card next up we got darnell dockett of the card solid not a bad card probably not a standout solid. card but when you power him up to 90 he's gonna stand out look at that speed 70 at 87 overall Woo! watch yeah. out four three the big beast dude. he's a big dude not the best defensive tackle in this promo but man, you gotta be happy, right? You gotta be happy. 4-3 beast, man, like, he started to get towards the area where you can also be happy running this cat in 3-4 in as well, man. At this end. is just a great, you, yeah. yeah, at end, whatever, wherever you want, man. Like, this is really, really solid. So yeah, I, I'm happy for Donnell Duckett fans out there. Yeah, man, oh, man, they just nailed it with these players too, man. They really nailed it. This is so cool. Darnell Duckett, nice ad right there. Next up, Lofa Tapatu, Tatapu, Tatupu, Lofa Tatapu. You should be nailing this. I should this. be nailing this. I know, it's late, okay? Blood. Everybody just calm down. Tatapu Lofa is Tatupu. here for you. 79 speed, middle linebacker Tupu. for the Seattle Even Seahawks. I know how to say this, but that's mainly because I grew up watching rugby and like, there's about two million Tatupus running around playing for Tonga, right? So like, like <laughs> Tatupu. Oh, dude, I think this is really cool. One thing I love, absolutely love, these old school Seahawks jerseys. Oh yeah. Because they're so ugly. That's the thing. I just I dig <laughs> it. I have a I have a Marshall Lynch. I have a beast mode team issue. He never wore it. It was like the extra spare jersey they put in like the in the travel pack, right? I actually got the that. The travel for issue beast mode throwback. I like it. 
No, but dude, it's team issue. Like, he would have worn it one game, but he never needed it. I actually have it from this Reebok version of the of the Seahawks jersey. I freaking love that. And I, I, like, I really like this card. Um, I really like this item. I just wish he was a tiny bit faster, director. Yeah, well, I, I mean, I, you I, power I, him I up. I think it gets to, what, 82, 83? So it's not uh, terrible, but... 81. 81. Ooh. Yeah, but I just I gotta tell you, man. Like I love the I love the fact that this is such a rare name and such a rare card. I mean, when will we ever see him again? And like I really, really wanted him to get get that like Mad Islander respect in there as well, man. I think that these cards are definitely gonna get boosts throughout the year as well, which is so great because they really inflated the names that we have in Madden Ultimate Team this year. So you can expect yeah. Lofa to get maybe into the high 80s, maybe in the next couple of months. Who knows? At one, at some stage, he will be on my team, yeah. without a doubt. Very, very Calling cool. It. Next up, we've got the Titan, Keith Bullock. Dude, this Solid. is one of the better cards, I think, in this promo, yeah. especially at his position, right outside linebacker. You're going to get him up until, what, 83, 84 speed. I've seen some. I think I yeah. saw him in some Titans uh, theme teams. That's why he had such high speed. Can we... Can we just go? I mean, we're, we're running over on this show anyway. So anyone watching, you, you're in it for the long haul. Can we check the zone coverage on it? Let's That's check the, the one zone thing coverage on this. I remember him being an odd as far as what his his attributes were. Let's see. So his zone is down here. So 78, actually. 78. That's pretty good. Yeah. Not bad. You Okay, so you start to get in the flats. I think it's 75 plus you get a good reaction. So like that is like... That is pretty nice. Guys, I would love, 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 love to hear uh, feedback in the comments on how this how this item's playing if you're running him. Um, we should ask Venetian Sausage, yeah? Yeah, some of our <laughs> Titans fans in the chat. But take a look at him all the way powered up. 83 speed. Let's take a look at his zone at this stage right here, too. Zone coverage is at 81. 81. And I think that's man. one of the top echelons you can 83 get. 83 man and 81 zone on a linebacker. That's pretty crazy. That's better than Seahorn's 86 stats. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. Yeah. That's this sick, this man. is a very, very, very good item. I think there's nobody better it. in the game right now if you're running 4 3. Like, this is yeah. the guy. This is who you need to go be yeah. picking up. And I've seen a lot of Happy yeah. Titans fans absolutely yeah. excited to see him added. Um, yeah, if I was still running 4 3, he would be an instant <laughs> ad for me right now. Uh, so Keith Bullock nailed it. Next nice. up, we got nice. Peanut. Oh, you know, I love go. me some peanut, bro. Charles Tillman, oh. one of the fan favorites in this house, at least. Really love Charles Tillman. So good. And this is a beast of a car, too. Matter of fact, Trumpet Monkey, I mean, uh, we, 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 went, we went ahead and added this cat to the Oh, squad. let's go! Take a look at this guy right here, Charles Tillman. Now, the, the reason I bring this up is because of what Trumpet Monkey brought Ooh. up before in the episode about using Ooh. your power-up passes. So I had Jalen Ramsey with my power-up pass as my number one cornerback right now decided to take the power pass off, go pick up Charles Tillman's power up for about 30K, and then use the power up pass on him to get him up to a 90. All in all, cost about, what, 2K training and 40,000 coins. Ugh. Super worth it for a guy like Charles Tillman. You got that power up pass. <laughs> mm. Um, That's awesome. That's so cool. I like, I, and I still have my 87, 88 power up pass. I was kind of sitting on it, until maybe team of the week and see does something sick come out there, you know, like like see what we can maybe get there. But uh, mm. you got Charles yeah. Tillman now, it's man. Tempting. Let's take a look at his stats. It's six tempting. two. Uh, let's see. On my team, he's got eighty seven speed. He's got uh, eighty six man coverage, eighty seven zone, eighty three press, uh, ninety play, ninety play rec, ninety play rec. He's gonna animal. be animal. And you know he better have the strip bowl trait. He better have the only animation in the game that is the punch bowl trait. Oh yeah. Right? So, <laughs> Punching out that ball, causing those fumbles. That's awesome, bro. I think out of all the cards that came out, this is probably one of my favorite, at least top three. Yeah, Charles yeah. Tillman, such a big name, fits on the Bears and the Panthers. I think he's a must add. It's in my opinion, must add. He nuts awesome, man. Come on. Speaking sick. of must add, Dwight Freeney. Whew. Okay, maybe not must add, but he's gonna be a gnarly, gnarly. Why not bar. must have? Like I don't understand. Like he's on your team. Okay. He's on your team. He gets he gets pull up the pull up. How is this not a must have? He gets edge threat as well. He does get edge I mean, threat as well. Let's take a at look this. at this cat. He does have Chargers cam on him, so he's a bit boosted up. He's 91 overall with 82 speed, 91 finesse move. He is fantastic. Now, what? the only this reason a, I would say is not must have. add is because I think you can definitely get away with a DeMarcus Lawrence that comes with those cams, those abilities. 
it's much cheaper. But if you want somebody that's gonna perform similar to Lawrence Taylor, has similar speed, the spin of a tornado in Oklahoma, I think Dwight Freeney is the move. And I honestly, he's only been on my team, what, one day? He's shown up. He's shown the <laughs> hell up. He's a very, very nice guy. Nice. nice. It's Dwight rad, Freeney. Bro. And he played for like 6,000 teams. So go take a look and see if he fits on your theme team. Next up, we got Merton Hanks. <laughs> Yeah, I like I like this item right here simply because he's going to get over the zone threshold and he's going to be six foot two and he's going to be ridiculously fast. It's exactly what you want. I don't care about the low hip power, man. I just want him. I want him getting there and making plays. He was in contention for my power up pass. I'm going to say that right now, just because when you power him up, he's going to be what, like 86 speed. That's awesome. That's great. That's the Dude. fastest fat free safety. I think we have in the game right now, other than uh, what's his face and What's his face? It really came down to his hit power for me. I think I don't. I'm not very confident in 59 hit power, but it is free safety. I don't care. Dude, if I'm relying on my free safety to make hits, the other guys already scored. So yeah, <laughs> yeah. I guess that's true. I guess that's true. But you can get him up to 90 zone, 90 play rec. That's gonna work absolutely oh, fantastic. So two direct in contention for power up passes. If you want someone you can rely on at the free yeah. safety, because it's kind of a it's kind of a barren position this year in Ultimate Team. Dude, Dwight Freeney is in contention for power-up pass for me as well. I'm Let's take a look there. at Bruce Wayne. Wayne, Wayne Krabat. Ladies and gentlemen, for your entertainment purposes, here in the Las Vegas Lounge, Wayne Krabat. I don't know. It's just such a good name. It's great. It's he could be a name. porn star. He could be a politician. He could be a, a lounge singer. He, he could just do anything. Or he, could, or he could be an outstanding wide receiver in the NFL. 85 speed stock on the 88. I'm going to guess he's going to get 86, 87 when you power him up. Uh, the Ooh. catch in traffic is ridiculous. I'm thinking if you're looking for a slot wide receiver, <laughs> this is probably one of the guys you want to take a peek at Trumpet Monkey because he, he it, what slot receivers are designed to do what? Run in the middle of the field, get catch smacked, the and come ball down the ball. in the slot. <laughs> catch the ball in traffic. I think this guy is going to be one of the better ones that you can rely on, not to mention his short and medium rat running. Looks pretty nice. Uh, only a receiver for the Jets, by the way. There's only like three or four cards that have that one exclusive team. He's one of them. Let's move on to Corey Schlesinger. Schlesinger? <laughs> yeah. 75 oh, speed at man. fullback. It's not too shabby. It's not too shabby, man. I dig it. I'm digging him. I like it. I like I mean, come on. Like, what a name as well. Corey Schlesinger. That's it. I'm just going to call him Corey back, Wedding though. Singer. He's a fullback. He's, He's going to get, what, like 77 speed. He's going to have 90 He's lead the, block. I'm curious to see how he performs. The best fullback in the game, though, man. The best fullback in the game. Look at those Look at those arms. Look how small the ball is. That's a full-size <laughs> NFL ball, and he's holding it like it's an apple. This is a man's man. It's a big This dude. is the kind of guy you go on a, a riverboat casino trip with. You make your own beef jerky. I want to make a pillow fort with this guy in my bedroom. Okay. Okay, that came out wrong. All right, let's All right, move on. Great, let's, great sorry, Corey. Clinton I apologize. Portis. Ooh, ooh, Clinton Portis. Ooh, ooh. Why is this guy good? Tell me now. Hurry. Oh my God. Well, because it's Clinton Portis. He has the mutt force X factor. He's just gonna like run through dudes for you, right? Uh, that and also for all those poor Bonkos fans out there that got the kicker. At least you got a Clinton Portis as well. Yeah. That's the one thing I don't like about this card. Other than that, <laughs> he's what? Like, he's a, he's almost a clone of Marcus Allen. Uh, just much. absolutely crazy good. Power him up. I think he's 88 speed. Adrian Peterson. Just, just an animal. I saw Wheels put a video out with this guy, and you got to go check it out sometime, dude. Like, he literally jukes a guy out, ducks underneath another defender, takes it all the way to the house, and that's just Clinton Portis every day. Average Tuesday for Clinton Portis. Doing crazy. Doing Clinton Portis things. Go get him. Looks sick. I, I'm, I'm actually thinking about it. I'm really thinking about <laughs> Clinton Portis. Next up, we got Antoine Randall L. 86 speed wide receiver Such for the Steelers. First and foremost, the best name. The best name in the entire promo. It's got to be up there. Randall there are some great names. Antoine Randall L. I mean, come on. That's a fantastic name. And this is a nice item. I like it. I think, I mean, I think Gut Fox is pretty pumped. I think Steelers, Steelers fans out there feeling pretty pumped today there, director. Feeling good. Um, look at that deep route running, 85. I dig it, man. He's going to be fast, too. Yeah, he's going to be like fast. It. On a Steelers theme team, I think get him to like close to 90 speed without much effort. So not a bad card there. Wah. 
Wah, wah, I love it. I love everything about it. JJ the Elo. Next card. JJ the Elo. JJ the Elo. He's a kicker. Wilowski. It's me. It's Stevie Wilowski. It's JJ the Elo. All right, next card. Let's go. Don't eat. That's all. Leave it. That's all the people who me here. Otto's coming back. Otto, can this guy just can this guy please take a photo where, where he doesn't look like a train's coming like, at him? Like, oh yeah. man, oh dude, but what a what a man, what a legend! I, I've heard some talk on the street about Otto Graham though. I haven't played with him. I don't know what he plays like, but I've heard some dudes tell me that there's something about Otto Graham's release that he is a much yeah. faster quarterback getting his passes off. And wow. if that is true. He may be highly coveted, and it's Otto Graham. He's got decent speed, really good attributes, and if he can get the ball out faster than any other quarterback in the game, maybe worth a try. So like last year in PC when we first got there, I took a low overall Otto, Otto Graham from his, uh, I think, legend set. Yeah, because UL's had to come out. And um, and he was, my, uh, he was my budget QB, and I can attest to the fact that he's good. He's highly accurate. His throw power wasn't great back then, but now they've seemed to have gone the other way. He you know, dropped off a little bit of that short accuracy in order to give him a little bit more throw power. I did. Look at that deep accuracy, 88 deep. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. And he power up to Rad, 90. Man. One thing you did say that I really like about these cards that I'm noticing with a lot of them is that it feels like the attributes feel more appropriate to the name. Yeah. And that's something I haven't yeah. really felt in a couple of Maddens. So good on the EA team for paying attention yeah. to those small details. Next up. For real. Okay. Before we take it away, director. Before Sean we Phillips. we we go over the Chargers player, I'm gonna say one thing. Okay, <laughs> I was like 99% sure that this was gonna be a different player, and I'm just gonna show you guys something I created in anticipation of that, and then we're gonna break down the Chargers player. Here we go. Second Broncos, lights out. Sipping tea in Britain, lights out. Find a wizard's hat, lights out. Make some pastries, lights out. Grab a beer with a bud, lights out. Make it finger licking, lights out. Steal the neighbor's cable, lights out. <laughs> Tebow time. Uh, yeah. Making nachos, lights out. Doing taxes, lights out. Hating broccoli, lights out. Thinking about death, lights out. Suppressing emotions, lights out. Snacking on a pretzel, lights out. Baking apple pie, lights out. Diamond in the sky. <laughs> John Merriman. <laughs> That's why. Now, even though we didn't get Sean Merriman the legend, the real Sean Merriman caught the video, and he thought he thought it was pretty great. We got the yo, we got we got the the approval from Lights Out himself. Yo. So even though we didn't get the diamond, I feel like my job is done. And with that, let's get I back. Love the Tebow time, by the way. The Tebow time was great because you and your brother look so alike, but I thought it was like you taking the knee and then whammo. It's like, what? It's great, man. Let's take a look at who the Chargers really got in Sean Phillips. Nothing against Sean Phillips, though. After all yeah. of that, I really do like the pick. Now, Sean Phillips is going to be very, very, very good in 3-4. You got. Let's take a look at the one on, on my team. Just, just, yeah. just, just show to, the folks, yeah, man. Just, just to show the folks that what we're working with. Don Phillips. Ooh. I'm moving to a three-four because Ooh. of this man in LT. This guy gets edge threat, and I think finesse specials. I have to check it out. He's gonna be very, very, very good. 81 speed. Dude. Definitely. He, he's pretty much Von Miller. I think is what you're looking Ooh. at here. Nice. Not too bad. Not too bad. bad. So Sean Phillips, excellent card. Uh, not Sean Merriman, but I can live with it. I can definitely live with it. Next up, we got Brian Waters <laughs> coming in for the, uh, let's see, let's put this a little bit. For the Chiefs. For the Chiefs. This is like the linemen that they bought out in this promo are so good, man. Like, so, so good. These are like the greatest linemen in the game right now. Oh, man. Solid, right? Solid, man. If you if you if you can afford to get him, get him. That's what I got to say. You know, you know, you might. Yeah. You know when a celebrity box gets uh, <laughs> overpacked at like a sporting's event, and then all of a sudden the yeah. guy that was in there that booked the place is upset. Feels like Larry Allen might be in that situation right now, because <laughs> th these guards and everything, man, they are very, very, very good. So pick yourself yeah. up some linemen while you're out and about. 
I did yeah. as well. He's one coming up. Let's take a look at Mel Renfro. Another really good card. I would say God. probably one of the better ones if we weren't getting yeah. a Willie Brown tomorrow. Yeah, definitely. I love it as well. Everyone was like, Mel Renfro, gotta have him. And then Willie Brown comes and steals his thunder like that. Like that. There it is. But yeah, Mel Renfro goes without saying. He's an amazing item. So uh, you cannot go wrong with this dude in your team, guys. For I think real. this is EA telling us, hey, guys, maybe get some more speed on your cornerbacks because something's coming. Yeah, let him. Something's coming. You want to make sure little. you're ready. Get some speed out there at defensive back. Next up, John Runyon. Okay. Great name. Yes. Runyon with the Funyon. 6'7". Huge. Go make sure these linemen... Uh, fit on your theme team if you haven't already looked to check out the video that we posted below. I didn't know this guy was a San Diego Charger. Don't remember him. But you know what? <laughs> this is the first time in Mutt history I can remember having a 90 overall uh, offensive lineman this early in Madden. Is he in your team? He is on my team. Matter, Show us! Matter, I want to see fact, this! fact, bro, like, this is what I'm talking about with these legends. I went and picked up his power up for like 25k. Here he is. Just an 87 overall card, on the team. He'll be 90 eventually, but I'm super happy with that. Look you at didn't that. You get the full card. Get that off the screen, Not director. Yet, bro, what but this doing? is a good example. Go pick up the power up pat or the power up card and go power him up as far as he can if he fits You're in your cool. theme team. Because hot damn, it feels good. It feels good to have linemen cool. that can hold line with your theme team. Very, very nice. Jesse That's Tuggle really cool. coming up next. In a linebacker. Good talk. Falcons. That's pretty cool. This guy right here is pretty awesome too. I mean, like, and I know like Falcons players love this. So, um, I mean, look, look at that. Look at that block shed, that hip power. So like, this is a pass rushing uh, linebacker, I'm assuming with zone being that low. Pretty nice, man. Here's what I would do if I were Falcons fans, man. You got, you got uh, Deion Jones running as your CPU defender because he's got really nice zone. Use Jesse Tuggle and bash some heads in, man. With that hit power <laughs> under your user power, and he's going to have decent cool. speed at like, what, 80, 82, 83, 84. That is pretty nice. So I like that combo of middle linebacker for Rex the Falcons. Bulls. Wreck some dudes coming over the middle. Jesse Tuggle, what a name. This is great. And this one, let me take John Henderson. If you haven't seen the John Henderson pre-game slap me in the face fire off videos. He played his last two seasons for the Raiders, right? He just went and took a paycheck. That's fair enough, man. But he was truly a Jags great and a legend. He would literally have one of the training staff slap him in the face before he went out on the field. Six foot seven. This for me is I wouldn't the want best that job. Team. This, yeah, this is the best ET in the game right here. I really, really want him. Very, very easier said than done on PC. So I like I can't even get his power up. So I'm watching, I'm waiting, anticipating. Oh my god, this this is a monster of a hybrid card, guys. He can play, he can play your nose tackle, right? Which is his technical position in real life, or but but he can also pass rush. Yeah. Like like this this is an insane item. He's huge. I think he's one of the Six few defensive up. tackles in the game that can get run stuff as well as an ability. That's and right. I, I haven't right. seen that, that yet, so I'm curious. Three hundred and thirty-five pounds, six foot seven. He has sixty speed, nearly ninety block shed, ninety strength, and eighty-six power move when you take him all the way out. It's insane, man. So yeah, I want this guy bad. I want him bad. Good luck, Trump and Monkey. I hope Thanks, he comes bro. around. Next up, we got Donald Driver. Who doesn't remember Donald Driver, Dude. man? Awesome. Aaron awesome. Rodgers to Donald Driver. Never a awesome. bad idea, dude. And this is a very there's good so idea. Many, there's so many wide receivers to consider for the monkey slot position. I just don't know who to pick, man. I'm going to take my time with it, I think. Wait till the prices come I down. I really like bit. this Donald Driver, man. Well, he'll have 88 yeah, speed, like 85 catch in traffic. That seems pretty just, dang good to me, dude. This These stats are insane, man. Yeah. Like, he's 85 or above on every single route run. And like, and then like the lowest catch is 84 catch in traffic. This and 87 speed. This is an this is an awesome item right here, yeah. guys. This is a great wide receiver. Very very nice. Next up, Jordan Gross from hey, Utah. Hey. Not Timmy, bad. didn't Timmy from New Zealand, the Panthers fan, call this one? I think he did. Did he really? Pretty sure he did. Yeah, I think he did. He was like, I think we're getting Jordan Gross. Um, this is nice. This is really really nice. Again, um, the linemen in this promo are next level. Like, holy crap, you probably don't have to worry about alignment for a long, long time if you get any of these. Yeah. Uh, really solid. Yeah. Pick them up. Very, very nice. Next up, we got Rob Nikovich. Love Not it. Not unfamiliar to Love the Madden it. community. 
love it. I The only complaint here is I feel like he was actually faster than this, man, in pads. I don't care what he ran in 4-4 time. Like, but still, you're happy for the pads, right? But man, just a little bit more speed would have been legit, I think. Yeah. For a defensive end, it's it's definitely not slow, but it would be oh, nice to see him just a little bit faster. Adam oh. Timmerman coming up next, right guard Rams. Dude, and I just wish some of these guys had like played for the Raiders at some point. Some oh, of these me too. But for the Chargers. The dude, um, for the Raiders. Oh, thank you. Uh, and a bit, uh, no, again, another solid lineman here. Just one, once you start getting closer to those 90 stats, at least everything above 80, 86 here on this guy, it's pretty solid, man. I just... You're building a great wall of your team, of somebody's team, if you can get all five of these linemen in your in your team. Oh yeah, for sure. Next up, we got Chris McAllister, cornerback. Woo! Probably like the forgotten corner of this promo, right? Yeah. I mean, nice, like decent speed, decent coverage stats, decent uh, height. But at the same time, everyone's going to be like on the, the Tillman, Seahorn hype train, the Sertain hype train. Um, don't forget about this, dude. I'm sure Ravens fans haven't. Like Ravens fans are, are sitting there going, dude. And uh, Saints are, fans oh as well. Yes, so yes. Yeah, because he, he did go over there, right, for his last season, I think. Um, so, uh, man, that Ravens secondary is looking like next level. Yeah, at it's the pretty moment. disgusting. Oh, my God. When you get Ed Reed and Earl Thomas, holy crap. Yep. Not passing on the Ravens this year. Really good card, but again, he is like the third one I would choose out of the ones <laughs> we got here because the other two are just yeah. spanking good. Next up, oh, Deuce. <laughs> Deuce, Deuce, McAllister. Deuce McAllister. Let's go. 84 speed. Another power back in the game. Not as fast oh. as uh, our, our Bengals halfback, but he is in the arm bar as well. Yeah. Bruiser. Look at that man, 80, 89 truck, man. It just, you know what, this card, you know what these power back cards get me excited for? Beast mode. Is like what, is is for Bo Jackson, if they bring him out power back, okay, Bo and beast mode. Which one are we going to get, you know? Oh my God. Bro, if and, if I, Bo Jackson comes out in Madden 20, he will be the meta. He will be a walking aura of meta. <laughs> that is all he is, is 100% composed of I meta. Am. I am the cannot, meta. Cannot um, imagine what he would look like. Saints fans are pumped for this one, right? For Juice, though. Let's give Juice his juice. All right, we want to hear. I want to hear about. I want to hear some war stories in the comments about Juice wrecking fools and running over dudes. Though that's what I need to hear. Yeah, I want to see how you guys are handling the bruiser and the armbar. Next up, it's the wrong car. Not, <laughs> not, not Derek. David Carr. So cool that he's in the game, though. Very, very difficult to build. Especially on PC with with needing clowny, right? Oh my God, you you need clowny and um. I oh, I got a just, I got a, such a kick out of seeing him come through those promos. Like no freaking way they got David Carr, and his attributes look really good. really good. 88 yeah. throw power, the 88 medium, 74 speed, which is not yeah. slow, and you can power no. him up. Not a, and he he fits on a couple of theme teams. He's got the, uh, the Niners and the Panthers and the Giants and the Giants Texans. And like Texans, four, yeah. He bounced around. It's, so it's this, crazy, this is a nice item. man. It's really cool that he's in there. Man, he's like so similar to to his younger brother. It's crazy. Like so, hey, I just want my Derek now. Let's get a Derek, please. <laughs> I a million percent. Like if there was anyone, I was like, so I was thinking we're getting Sean Merriman for sure. It didn't happen, right? I thought for sure this was going to be Arian Foster. I thought for oh. sure this would be Arian Foster. A lot of people were thinking Andre Johnson as well. I mean, yeah. but I think David David was the first face of the franchise, man. Yeah, I mean, like seriously, yeah. I think this is a good This goal. is a young franchise, so I like that. It's very nostalgic is what we'll say. Matt Burke coming up next, center for the Love Vikings. This. Very good. Solid Love 89 this. awareness. Dude. Love this guy right here, man. Like, love him. And um, uh, again, all the old linemen, they just nailed this. Yeah. You know, you know I think, like, like, I, like, shout out to Stoney and the Jedi clan, the Jedi Mudhead clan. He was like, man, they, they, like, he was, he was a little upset that we got, that they got a center of the bikes. Cause there are a lot of historical, amazing bikes players. But if you're going to get a center, then you get the best one. There you go. And last but not least, we have got the master of this promo, Kurt Warner. Good Lord. From groceries to gridiron, this man made a name for himself. Amazing. Uh, this is going to be one of the hardest quarterbacks to compete against if you've got the corner. Incredible. And that's Tell him why. Tell him why, director. It comes down to abilities. 
with Kurt Warner. He is not fast, but he meets all the thresholds when it comes to passing. Throw power is decent, not the best, but decent. But he's also going to be able to get, forget what the ability is called, like technician, route master, I think it's route master, where you're able to put all of the additional hot routes on every single receiver on your side of the field. Absolutely game breaking at this point because you're thinking right now, if I'm going to put, you know, route master or slot master, or whatever, on my other wide receivers, it's going to take up an entire slot for your X factors. This guy Dude. is taking every single one of your receivers and making them X factor. Dude, game let breaking. me let me paint a picture for you. You put you put go deep on this guy right here. That throw power becomes 90. The deep accuracy 94. Imagine that. It's insane. And on it's top insane. of that trumpet monkey, now not a lot of people have been talking about this yet, but there is a threshold for the threshold, if that makes sense. So when you hit 93 overall, you're going to be able to unlock tier 3 abilities in your second slot. So whatever is glitchy on Kurt Warner, you can get two of them. You can get the route master, and I think he might be eligible for protector as well which makes all of your linemen, uh, uh, your offensive linemen, protect you that much better. So if you've got the coin and you're running with Kurt Warner, throw me some dough, let me hit you up in your mansion, because he's very, very expensive. But if you are able to use him right now, you're going to have an advantage if you know how to use Kurt Warner that nobody else in the game would have right now. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to see. Oh, my God. You know what this got me excited for? This got me excited for Endgame. Yeah, it end did. game is going to be like, very interesting with the X factors and abilities this so year. So fun, so crazy, so fun, man, so fun. You know, I, I dig it, man. That's a great master as well. I don't care about the speed. I'm fine with that because, like, this is your pocket passer right here. Yeah. Just literally a cannon of an arm with accuracy as well. It's like a sniper cannon. He's going to be fantastic. What is that? So if you guys are one of the rare chosen ones that have used Kurt Warner, <laughs> let us know in the comment section below. Let us know how glitchy he is. Hopefully, people get their hands in more quarterbacks like this in the coming months. This is what I want out of Philip Rivers. This is what this is what the future of yes. Philip Rivers looks like, and I could not be more excited. Well, John Monkey, I think that is going to do it for this episode. What a of show! Force. Yes, what a show! It was a long one what too, bro, show, but we got bro. it done. We got it done. That's so many. Ah, oh, that's such a good promo, man. I want it, but I want it. I want people's feedback on like what 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 was their favorite promo of all time in my. Um uh, and and hit us up in the comment section, man, because I got to tell you, this is taking the cake right now for me, director. Yeah, I think this is definitely my favorite promo I've ever seen in Madden Ultimate Team. It did not disappoint, and I'm excited to see maybe <laughs> part two. Nah, I'm not gonna say that, but maybe, Woo! maybe, maybe we'll have to see. I hope it's at least a new staple in Madden from here on out to get these lesser known legends, but a lot of yeah. them, because that means a lot yeah. to every individual fan base, which is great. Well, John Monkey, it's been a good show. Thank you so guys so yeah. much for joining us. If you enjoy this, hit us up with a like and sub. Hit us up with a like. Those likes really help us stand out in the Meow. YouTube analytic cyberspace. Meow. Damn straight. All right, John that's, Monkey. I think that's the thumbs up. Say goodbye to the good people. <laughs> Bye. This has been Director and Trap of Monkey, guys. Thanks so much for joining us. And as always, stay frosty. Last chance, fourth and long, finding the will to bolt up Bundle up cause you know we stay frosty I take my frosty chocolate vanilla or swirl Mutt master YouTuber, come on let's give it a whirl Mutt Madden Twitch streamer, put the snowman to shame Staying frosty's the only way we stay alive in this game They're in the match, directors directing the game Scared of my underdog team, you know them gods will be slain